Wanna find out how either of Myanmar President Win Mint performed in 2018? In a few moments, I will reveal you the real truth, so pay close attention. We'll analyze only the single most important metric to determine how successful leader was. Here's the deal. Most important performance metric for any leader is happiness of citizens. Its number composed of multiple variables, including GDP per capita, social support, healthy life expectancy, freedom to make life choices, generosity, and perception of corruption. Basically, it measures performance of whole government led by the leader of the country. If you are from Myanmar, comment below how happy you were in 2018. Our data source will be UN's The World Happiness Report. UN stands for United Nations. We'll analyze two main factors. Position in 2018 happiness report and change in rankings. Based on those factors, all leaders get grades. Grades are phenomenal, which is the best, amazing, excellent, great, good, then fair, which is neutral, mediocre, poor, bad, awful, and abysmal, which is the worst. If country dropped ranking from last year, leader can't get positive grade. Is that clear? And now, are you ready? Leader of Myanmar, President Win Mint, in 2018 performed, drumroll, wait for it, bad. You can best visualize it by seeing how high this red arrow is. And now, few numbers. His score was minus 917, and he ranked 113th among all leaders. Myanmar was ranked 129th in 2017, which is low. And in 2018, they dropped two places to 131st place. So as you can see, it's bad job. Your leader is making you more unhappy. If you now want to see how Myanmar ministers in charge of finance and economy performed in 2018, click the link in the top right corner. And that's not all. Let's see few leaders that performed best, so you can see how phenomenal performance looks like. Here is the top of the rankings. Rank number one was leader from Benin, Patrice Talon, president of Benin. He did phenomenal job and Benin recorded a jump of 33 places in the rankings. Awesome! Rank number two was leader from Kosovo, Ramush Haradinaj, prime minister of Kosovo. Phenomenal job, Kosovo jumped 90 places in the rankings. Rank number three was leader from Italy, Giuseppe Conte, president of the Council of Ministers of Italy. In 2018, Italy leaped 11 places from 47th to 36th place. Now, before you go and watch next video, remember to subscribe and click bell icon so you don't miss new 2019 rankings. I will analyze 2019 performance as soon as new UN ratings become available. Bye!